welcome back to my channel. If you're here, make sure to subscribe down below. So today I'm gonna be telling you why I am never going to dye my hair pink ever again. Okay, and why my hair is literally so damaged, and that's why it's literally up to here, and this is all extensions. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you why my hair is so damaged. I'm just gonna tell you the story. So this is gonna be a story time in my little corner. Okay, this is gonna be called my story time corner when I have a story to tell y'all. It's gonna be here in this corner. Okay. So I'm gonna start off this story with I have always been obsessed with pink, whatever, we all know that, and I've always wanted pink hair. I've done blonde, brown, and red. And I've like put like, you know when you put Kool-Aid in your hair? I've done that too. But um, I've never went to the extent of like bleaching it and doing it pink, except for the story that I'm about to tell you. So get your popcorn, get whatever, okay? I'm gonna tell you some my story, okay? So it all started when I was seeing this guy. Okay, seeing, I went on one little date with him, but it was seven hours, so you know what? This when I was seeing this guy, I'm finna say. Okay, so I went on this day with this guy, and he had a tattoo. And on his tattoo, it literally was like a girl. She looked just like me. She had glasses, everything, but they she had like light colored hair. And this guy told me he's like, oh, I love when girls have different colored hair. And like that clicked in my mind. I was like, oh, that'd be so cool if I dyed my hair like something cool. So literally, I was. It was just like in the back of my mind, like subconsciously, whatever. And then I remember I was. And then I like remember I was on a run and when I was on my run I seen this girl she's riding her bike oh tumbler she had the coolest bike ever she had her hair a different color and I was like that girl is so cool I want to be like her so I literally text Tana as fast as I can okay and I literally was like yo Tana you need to pick me up I need to dye my hair right now I was like oh my bank account is in the negatives right now I am in college and I really can't afford to go and get it done my overdraft was like negative like 150 at this point so if i took the rest of the money to get my hair done i would have no money to like go out and party or anything so i was like okay we're gonna do this the cheapest way and i'm gonna look as cool as i possibly can so you know what we're gonna get holly to dye it okay we're gonna get holly to do my hair which is my other friend that i know tana from so i call tana i'm like yo i need a ride you need to drive me before i even ask holly then as i'm literally running while doing all this then i call holly i was like yeah can you bleach my hair for me and dye it pink she's like yeah sure come over and i was like bless up so i literally went Got showered, got ready, packed my stuff, went, I literally live in well at the time, dry to St. Catharines, whatever. Tana picks me up, we go, we go to Sally's, I got bleach, and then we went and we got like a pink box hair dye. I'm gonna put it right here with this pink box hair dye. Cause Tana told me she dyed her hair this color pink and she said that it came out like peachy and that it should be fine if I bleach my hair first before I do it. So I'm like, okay, all these people know so much. Okay, well I'll listen to all of them, okay? Holly has done my hair before and I've done Holly's hair. We've all just done each other's hair, we know what we're doing, okay? So we go and we do it, okay? So I go, I have just natural, like very nice, natural brown hair, okay? My roots go to about here. So my hair is natural here to here brown and the rest is like, is just brown, okay? It's not, it was like dyed brown, but this was like my natural went down to here. But it blended very nice and my hair was just brown. One day Holly's like, no, I'm too tired, like I can't dye it. So I'm like, okay, that was the night of. She's like, oh no, I'm too tired, I can't dye it. I'm like, come on, please Holly, can you please just do one half? Like, please just at least bleach it a little bit. Please. Like, I, I'm here and I want to do it now because if I don't do it now, then I'm never going to do it. I need to do it now. The impulse is now and I feel the need to do it now. And if I think too long, I'm not going to do it. So she's like, okay, fine, whatever, I'll bleach it. So she goes, she bleaches my hair, okay? My hair comes out like straw. Like, my hair is dead at this point just from bleaching it once. Every single time I bleach my hair, my hair comes out dead because my hair before is like already really dry and not very nice. So my hair literally comes out like straw yellow and it like literally does not look good my roots are two different colors and my hair is this color i'm like okay like at least i'm somewhere you know what i'm saying so then she goes i think i'm gonna have to bleach your hair again you're gonna have to go back to the store go buy more bleach and then we have to bleach your hair again and i'm thinking back in my mind i'm broke right now i can't afford to go buy more first of all second of all i'm like i am so impatient i'm the most impatient person ever i'm like i'm so impatient like i can't like you need to just dye it pink right now i don't care it's gonna come out fine it will be fine holy like let's just do it she's like amanda like I'm, I'm pretty sure like you're gonna have to bleach your hair again like i don't think it's going to work the way you want it to and i was like nah it's fine just dye it pink so she goes and she dyes it pink like looking at it and we're like holy shit it didn't take the color and then i was like no it's fine like we've just got to wait a little longer so i remember having it in my hair like even longer and i remember just keeping it in my hair for like an hour and i was like no it'll be fine it'll be fine whatever then i wash my hair and i literally blow dry as fast as i possibly can and i see the ends are still like bleach like bleach yellow blonde okay and i'm like holy shit what do i do and then i'm blow drying and as i'm blow drying it literally like i kid you not i will show you the video literally half of it like yellow and then the top half bright pink and i'm like are you kidding me what do i do i'm like what do i actually do in this moment in time because half my hair is yellow half my hair is 
pink and I don't know what to do because I have no money and like I just went through dyeing my hair so much that I can't just go buy brown and just dye it again and I plus I wanted my hair color pink I wanted it pink so bad so I just went around my life with my hair like this I ended up going for like weeks with my hair just curly and then so when I looked when my hair was curly it just looked ombre and it looked oh, like it looked decent like I'll show you videos like it looks decent here but like if my hair was straight it looked disgusting I literally looked ratchet the guy that I was seeing which I ended up ending things with that guy that I was went on seven hour day with and I ended up dating his brother <laughs> so his brother used to always say that I look like a porn star because my hair would look like it was such like because my hair looks so like weird. I look, he said that I look like a porn star. And I was like, and everybody all the time, you say I look like Mia Khalifa when I had brown hair before I dyed any of it. So then, whatever I went and I had, whatever I had my hair like this for like a couple weeks, okay? And like, I'll show you, keep, I'll just like keep on showing you pictures like from like a couple weeks, whatever. Of my hair looking like this. And I was like, I went back to my mom and I was like, okay, mom, can we please just try to dye my hair one more time? Like, please, I'm giving this pink thing one more time. So my mom goes and she dyes my hair pink again after me dyeing it 20,000 times. She goes and she dyes it pink again. Nothing happened. Nothing. Nothing happened. And on top of this, I had a little bit of roots now. So I tried dyeing my hair again and it was just like nothing happened. And I was like, great. So I'm just going to look like a porn star for the rest of my life. Wow, love this. Until my roots come in and then I'm gonna look like I'm broke and gross and I'm gonna look like I don't know what I'm doing with my life and I just look, you know. All together, this probably was like maybe a month, if that, not really, cause I was like, okay, I don't feel like myself. I don't feel good. I don't look good. My hair doesn't look good. My makeup doesn't look good. And back, I like, I couldn't even afford lashes back then cause I was literally call in college cause I went to summer school. So I was literally in college and I literally couldn't, my makeup looked like shit. I didn't feel good. I looked gross all the time. I just was like not feeling life. My hair was dead. I didn't feel good. I didn't look good. And then I was like, you know what? I'm over this, mom. You're dying my hair today. So we went to the store again. Okay, so at this point, my mom is buying my dye for me because I didn't have any money to buy dye. So at this point, like my mom was, was paying for it. So my mom would just, she always has dyed my hair just brown. Like she's always just done my hair brown or she's done a blonde. She, my mom's just like always done my hair just with a box. She's not, she's not professional and all that. Okay. I begged her first of all. She's like, Amanda, your hair's dead. You can't just keep on dying it. I was like, I am not going around like this anymore i can't my roots were coming out i was like no this is not a thing this is not a thing anymore okay i'm not pink i'm not i don't care i'm giving up the color pink no just kidding <laughs> so then we go to the store where she dyes my hair and my hair comes out literally black my hair comes out black and i'm like stressed at this point because i have like so many different kinds of extensions they're all light brown and my hair comes out black and i'm like great I love this for me no I don't love this for me but then I was in the back of my mind I was trying to be like positive I'm like oh it's fine like it's summer my hair will get lighter my hair will get lighter and ultimately my hair did get lighter and then I glowed up like literally from me going through this transformation I literally glowed up so much when I went back to school everyone was like holy shit because I look so good I was so myself I felt so much better but yeah like I I can't Tana literally said it to me after I bleached it she goes Amanda you could have just bought a wig and I'm like I could have just bought a wig. Oh my, like so true. I could have just bought a wig and now I do have a pink wig, but I literally don't wear it. Cause I'm like, nah, I'm not bringing that back. Like, no, like I feel like only certain people can like pull off pink hair, like or different colored hairs. Like I did an okay job, but I mean, it was not, it was not good. And then also I didn't think when I did it, I didn't think, oh shit, Amanda, you can't wear extensions. Oh, you can't do your hair that often because it's going to be dead. So literally my hair was either natural or it was, whenever I, if I didn't leave the house and my hair was always natural or it was, it was literally up in a pony. I remember I used to go to school once a week because I, the rest was online. I would always keep it up in a bun. I was like, I'm not dealing with it because then it looked fine when it was in a bun. But other than that, it was like, no. So do not get your friends to dye your hair pink for you. That is the first thing from all of this. Second of all, go to a professional if you do want to get your hair done. Don't get your parents to dye it. Don't get your friends to dye it unless they're actually good at it. Like, do not. I'm literally telling you, in box dye, don't do it. It's so much better to get a professional to do your hair because they know what they're doing. And I know it's expensive, but it's literally worth it in the end. That's all I'm going to say. So, yeah. I swear that I will never dye my hair pink ever again. I will just wear a wig or whatever. And I don't even want to bleach my hair because that is messed up too because your roots come in so fast. Like I literally didn't even think that, oh shit, after me dye my hair, I'm, my roots are going to be in in five seconds. I think I maybe might go back to brown. I don't know. I like it blonde, but I don't know. 
So anyways, like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you comment down below your favorite hair color and just in general. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. I don't know why I dab. I don't know why. Bye-bye. <laughs>